Hello there! In this video we will be adding TestNG plugin to our Eclipse. First of all, let's go to our browser. Let's search for TestNG plugin. TestNG plugin for Eclipse. Let's select our first option from official TestNG website. From here, let's select this link, install the plugin. Now we will have to scroll down. Once you see this link, go ahead and copy this. Right, now we can close the browser. Let's go to our Eclipse. Let's select Help. Install new software. And in here, you will have to paste the URL that we copied earlier and hit enter. All right, as soon as the test G came up, select this checkbox, click on next. All right, click next. Here we will have to accept the license agreement and then click on finish. Here just select install anyway and it will ask us to restart now. Go ahead and restart. Alright, so when our Eclipse will be restarted, TestNG will be already installed on your Eclipse. To do a very quick test, let's create some silly class. Let me go to our source package, let me go to our test. Let me just create a very quick test. Let me name it testng test. From now on, you don't have to select main method. Let's click on finish. In here, what we will type, we will type add annotation and type test and we will create quick method let's say public void hello and inside the method body let's just print something let's just say hello right so compiler will show us that there's some error let's click on it so what we will need to add we will need to add test ng library select that once you select it test ng library will be added to your project and now what we will have to do we'll just have to import test ng annotation hit on enter as soon as our code save to compile let's try to run it we'll be running as test ng test And in our console, we will see the output, right? So, if you see this output, it means you successfully installed TestNG. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.